guys, it's Sunday. It's like 1.30. I'm just sitting on my desk, just organizing myself. Things are going to get really busy. Yay! Um, next week is the last full week before school, before I start to like work. Yes. Hi, guys. So I already planned out the week yesterday, like what I want to get done. I want to get a lot of things done, like a lot of cleaning and organizing done. So it's like, I don't know. So that time, it's that time. We went back to school shopping yesterday, got all of their supplies minus, I think we still need, um, okay. please stop touching, you guys. Um, I think we just need Sharpie markers, not Sharpie. Actually, no, we got those yesterday, so we got everything. We're missing Jason's smock, which I could probably pick up at Michael's or something like that. But, um, <clears throat> Daddy. And we picked up their backpacks and sneakers. We didn't go school, uh, clothes shopping yet, but um, that'll all get done eventually. But um, anyway, I'm just like trying to get organized. I have, I, writ I wrote everything down. Like I'm better when I make lists and like I kind of make a plan. So basically yesterday I started on this and I just wrote down like all of my current projects, like all of my responsibilities and things and I grouped everything together and I have a bunch. One, two, three, four. Couple, like six, I don't know, projects, and kind of trying to organize it. So, because a lot of my time is going to be taken up now that I'm going to be working. It's weird to say working because it's not like your typical job. It's like you know, babysitting. Can you stop touching everything? Hold on, guys. So, being a mom isn't all glamorous. Like, it gets crazy frustrating sometimes. Like, de depending on the stage that your child is in, she's just into everything like everything like she's just her own little person likes to get into everything she shouldn't be getting into like she's got this jewelry thing right now smacking it together anyways I forgot what I was saying yeah so basically I'm just trying to get organized yeah I'm not gonna have a lot of enough a lot of time because I'm gonna be working and my work is like um, I'm le I'm going to someone's house to babysit too for kids I'm bringing Jordy um, but like while I'm there, I'm just gonna be sitting on my ass or anything like that. Like I'm gonna be doing like preschool basically. So I've been working on that. Like um, we're not just gonna be watching TV all day. I was a lot like this last school year. Like I was very structured. I don't think the vlog caught a lot of that. I think I've gone to you in there and I was doing little activities with Jordan because she was younger then. So it's gonna get a little bit more like intense. <laughs> She's still young, whatever, but one of the children I'm watching is four. I think she's four, so she'll definitely be able to catch on, I think. And um, Jordan and then the little boy that I'll be watching is a little bit younger than Jordy. But I plan to continue teaching Jordy as well, so like I take it seriously. I'm not just going over there to hang out with her kids, you know what I mean? So anyway, I have that going on, and then I still want to uh, stay on top of like YouTube and this vlog channel is going to be going through some changes most likely so I just need to figure out I wanted to write everything out basically like a brain dump so that I could figure out how to manage my time just got to the nail salon I'm nervous because the person that I normally see is busy so he's not going to be able to see me I accidentally stopped recording but yeah he's too busy today so I'm not able to see him usually when I can't see him which I've been seeing him for like over 10 years now when I can't see him I usually see his wife Sunny who did my nails last time but she's also busy so I'm trying out another lady so I don't recognize the name but doesn't mean I haven't seen her before but like uh, I'm most comfortable with the two um, the, my normal guy and his wife but we'll see what happens hopefully she's not rough on my cuticles we'll see what happens but here is my before and then I will show you my after. I want, I don't, this is not the shape that I wanted. So hopefully this other person will get the shape right. But we'll see, we'll see. I'll see you in a bit. Um, but I did pick up a little coffee. But anyway, here we go. When I went in, I just came out. When I went in, the guy that I normally see was available. Um, he had like a half hour before his next appointment came in. That's because I came in half hour early for my appointment so it worked out and I'm very happy with the way my nails came out it is the shape that I was trying to go for 
I guess it's a stiletto, stiletto nails. But I did want to go a little bit shorter, but um, I don't know. We'll see how this goes. But I really like the way it looks. I'm happy with it. The um, nails that I had last week, like the almond-shaped nails, I really wasn't feeling it. But anyway, I'm going to go head home now. Okay, so I just uh, cut up and seasoned up some potatoes, which I'm baking. And in the meantime, I have some uh, balsamic brown sugar rosemary pork chops going. I have to cook it in batches. This is something that I saw on Pinterest and decided to give it a whirl. So I don't know, hopefully it's good. It looked good on the picture, so we'll see. Um, I always like modify recipes a little bit when I try them, but um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. The potatoes, I just seasoned up however I felt like. I have some chopped up onion in there and garlic and some paprika, salt and pepper, some herbs, um, and I put some butter in it. So we'll see. We'll see how it turns out. Jordan, please. picked up another fish tank because the goldfish are getting big so we got them a five and a half gallon tank we, we were thinking about getting the ten gallon but the five and a half should be good well some of them are floating honey it'll sink it should sink every now I'll scoop them out oh they just float they seem to be pushed down yeah. they're going down once I touch them they're floating back down Nothing in there, right, Joel? So anyway, yeah. Hopefully, they could last in this one for a little longer. Look how good 
great. She is. <laughs> She's good for the pediatrician hey, too. Yeah, she is. Awesome. <laughs> She's yeah. sucking her thumb or pacifier. A pacifier. Yeah. All right. So that her teeth. See how like her like, top teeth yeah. and bottom teeth don't touch. Yeah. That's on the pacifier being in there. Hey guys, today is Tuesday. Um, we took Jordy to her first dental exam this morning. Uh, it was really good. She opened her mouth for the doctor and. Did everything that they asked her to do like they told her to say cheese they said to open her mouth and she did all those things um so everything's good everything looks beautiful she's already getting her two-year molars once those molars come in the back then she's gonna stay like that until she's like six so everything was beautiful okay i think we're gonna run to target real quick see if there's any sales and then jason has a dentist appointment to look at that tooth that's been bothering him then we have some more appointments later. So it's a busy day. But um, anyway, just wanted to check in, say hi. I still have to edit last week's vlog, which hopefully I get to today. <laughs> Jason's grumpy face. He's feeling some type of way because he just finished his dental appointment. He's not happy. Got a fill in, x rays, a clean in, the whole shebang, guys. He's sour that I made him do it. I just finished cooking dinner. Um, I tried this casserole recipe from Pinterest. I don't know, I'm a little freaked out because um, I like, I've like i made something similar with chicken, broccoli, and cheese. And then like I would make that and then put it over like pasta or something. But this one is like the same kind of thing, but like you cook rice in it. So I don't know, it's like super creamy. So I don't know, we'll see how it goes. Good morning, guys. Good morning, yes, good morning. Today is... What? Today is... What is today? Wednesday? Thursday. Today's Thursday. I didn't vlog yesterday. Didn't feel like it, honestly. I just have not been in the best of... I don't want to say not in a good mood. It's not my mood. It's just like, just, ugh. i off. I'm feeling a little off. Just overwhelmed with things. School starting next week. I'm going to start working next week. It's just I got a lot going on. So I didn't bother vlogging yesterday, but I was pretty productive. I wasn't feeling well again yesterday morning. I don't know why I've been having such terrible headaches. Like, terrible, like, headaches lately. But, um, anyways, I just finished editing the vlog. Oh, man, like, I tried, I want to have the vlogs up on Sundays. Today's Thursday, like, it just hasn't been working out for me. But I have to clean up. Oh, my God, you guys, like, I clean every day, and every day is, like, the same mess. Yes, let's put this away. We don't need a marker. But, yeah, um, the vlog is saving to my computer then i have to upload it do the thumbnail do the description box the whole freaking pro uh, process but i have to go upstairs and turn on the crock pots i forgot i was making crock pot meal today and it's like 11 like quarter after 11 so i wanted to have it in the crock pot already so i don't know i might have to cook it on high we'll see we'll see look at all this mess i tell you Anyways, I don't want to bore you with the freaking details of what I'm doing because it's the same thing every day. Clean, 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 clean. Organize. Kids. Cook. Same old, same old. But anyway, I just want to say good morning and I'll check, with in, check in with you guys in a little bit. I popped on the, uh, I popped the chicken into the crock pot. I don't know if I told you what I was making, but I'm trying... Um, crock pot orange chicken. I don't know. It's another Pinterest recipe. I think next week everything that I'm making is just like stuff that I already make. Like nothing new. I'm not trying anything new. I'm going back to like the basics. This past week I tried a whole bunch of like new things that I found on Pinterest because I was kind of in a rut. 
and I was running out of dinner ideas and I was tired of the same old same old so next week I'm going back to like my regular cooking so uh, yeah crock pot orange chicken so uh, I don't know I'm kind of nervous about it but it's 11:30, and I think since it's chicken breast probably like three or four hours on high and then like six or seven hours on low and I don't know like I don't I try to have dinner done by like six o'clock so if I cooked it on low the whole time it'll be late then it'll be late so <clears throat> I have it on high right now so I was thinking of doing is cooking on high for like two hours and then switching it over to low I've never done that before but I think it should be fine I am attempting fried rice I just have some sesame oil and onions I'm cooking the rice to fry it and Here's my slow cooker, orange chicken. I have some broccoli, carrots, peppers, chicken, and then I need like a sauce with soy sauce, orange marmalade, and barbecue sauce. Um, I didn't have regular barbecue sauce, so I used the Hawaiian barbecue sauce. Tastes good, tastes sweet. But other than that, I had a very productive day. I did a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. I did a whole bunch of stuff that I needed to get done. Um, before school starts next week. Hey guys. It's like after 1.30 and I'm waiting for the groceries. We got one half, we still have another half to go. Look at all these tattoos. Chatted up, yas. The kids are getting impatient. We've been waiting here forever. Say hi guys. It hasn't been an hour, DC. And I got DC's hair. We ran a couple errands today. <laughs> 